स्पॉन्सर्ड बाय कब्ज और उससे संबंधित तकलीफों का समाधान बैद्यनाथ कब्ज हार दे कब्ज में आराम प्राकृतिक और सुरक्षित With less than a month to go for inauguration of the Holy Ayodhya Ram Temple, Prime Minister Narendra Modi today arrived at the Holy City to gift Bharat a slew of developmental projects, held a mega road show, and addressed a mega rally in Ayodhya. He urged the 140 crore Bharatiyas to celebrate the Pavali on 22nd January, the date on which idol consecration in Ayodhya Ram Temple takes place, for which people around the world are eagerly waiting. PM Modi while addressing the mega rally in Ayodhya requested every Bharatiya to light a Shri Ram Jyoti in the respective houses to collectively celebrate Ram Temple's consecration ceremony. पूरे देश के 140 करोड़ देशवासियों को अयोध्या की इस पवित्र भूमि से प्रार्थना कर रहा हूं अयोध्या की प्रभु राम की नगरी से प्रार्थना कर रहा हूं मैं 140 करोड़ देशवासियों को हाथ जोड़ करके प्रार्थना कर रहा हूं कि आप बावीस जनवरी को जब अयोध्या में प्रभु राम विराजमान हो अपने घरों में भी श्री राम ज्योति जलाएं दीपावली मनाएं However at the same time he asked people to visit the temple only after January 23rd the day after the consecration ceremony his remarks come as ayodhya administration is expecting a huge footfall of ram devotees on January 22 mere sabhi deshwasiyon se ek karbaddh prarthna aur bhi hai har kisi ki ichha hai ki 22 january ko hone wale aayojan ka साक्षी बनने के लिए वो स्वयं अयोध्या आए लेकिन आप भी जानते हैं कि हर किसी का आना संभव नहीं है अयोध्या में सबका पहुंचना बहुत मुश्किल है और इसलिए सभी राम भक्तों को देश भर के राम भक्तों को उत्तर प्रदेश के विशेष करके राम भक्तों को मेरा हाथ जोड़ करके प्रणाम के साथ प्रार्थना है मेरा आग्रह है कि 22 जनवरी को एक बार विधि पूर्वक कार्यक्रम हो जाने के बाद 23 तारीख के बाद अपनी सुविधा के अनुसार वो अयोध्या आए The local bodies are already in full swing to prepare for security protocols to avoid stampede and to provide security to the high profile dignitaries who will attend the auspicious Ram Temple event on January 22. During his address PM Modi noted that the construction of the Holy Ram Temple will boost tourism in Uttar Pradesh particularly in Ayodhya. He also stressed on visitors convenience while inaugurating several developmental projects such as the Maharishi Valmiki International Airport, Amrit Bharat trains and Vande Bharat trains. He said that there was a time when Lord Ram used to live under a tent. but now he has a concrete house like the 4 crore people in the country got pakka houses mega projects inaugurated prime minister modi earlier today inaugurated the maharishi valmiki international airport which will help in tourists convenience pm modi expressed his happiness about the airport being named after maharishi valmiki who introduced us to the works of lord ram through ramayana The newly inaugurated airport has been developed at a cost of over rupees 1450 crores and is equipped to serve more than 10 lakh passengers annually. The visitors will also get to witness colorful murals depicting different stages of Ramayana and Lord Ram's life. PM Modi also flagged off two new Amrit Bharat trains and six Vande Bharat trains from Ayodhya Dham station. He dedicated the nation three railway projects worth rupees 2300 crore strengthening rail infrastructure in the region. The three-story modern railway station has been equipped with modern features such as escalators, elevators, food plazas, childcare rooms and waiting halls. 
PM Modi received a warm welcome with a large number of people showering petals at his convoy as he waved hands at the crowd. He also dedicated development projects worth Rs 15,700 crores to the state.